This is Timothy Chalamet. And yes, I hate him. Okay, so I usually steer clear of celebrities because they already get plenty of attention anyways. But this guy, I don't know. I just had to. And we all know why. Yeah. First, let's talk about his name. That's right. My name is Timothy too. And I spelled it with a Y. You know why? Because that's how you spell Timothy. Okay? Two E's? And one's accented? Really? Really? I know, I know. His dad is French. But come on. He was born in Hell's Kitchen, New York. And I'm not talking about that cool Scorsese grimy New York. I'm talking about the Disney owns Times Square Starbucks, New York. So really, with the Timothy, two E's and an accent? And yes, I know. He actually does speak French. He even picked up some Italian on that. Well, we'll talk about the movies. Now, you've heard me say here before, there is a fine line between costume and fashion. And this gentleman, he tiptoes along that line. But before we talk about fashion, let's talk about his career. Yeah, that's right. His first come up role, and that's right, it was fantastically genius, was him playing gay. What was the name of the movie? It was Call Me By Your Name, right? That's really when he hit the map. It, um, it's genius. It was genius to play gay. You know why? Because you get the entire gay male market and you get all the ladies. And we really don't need the straight market. You know why? Because the straight market's all playing video games. I mean, pretty much the only reason you know about this guy, if you're straight, is because your wife made you watch one of the movies he's in. John Mulaney, you know what I'm talking about. And let's be honest, ladies, I know you're watching because it's all romantic and all that, but really you just want to see some man-on-man -man action. I mean, come on, Brokeback Mountain, it was successful, we know why. And then he does two movies with this fantastic director who is right on the come up and is getting nominated for rewards. And they're really good movies. And he plays a king, a king. Let's be honest, we're all very, very excited about Dune, which he plays the lead in. I mean, probably one of the most epic movies to be made of recent, and he's a lead in it. But that doesn't mean, that doesn't mean chat my hide. You know what really frustrates me? Is he got to be in a Wes Anderson movie. The French Dispatch. You know what I would do to be in a Wes Anderson movie? Okay, let's talk about fashion. Now, I already kind of raved about this guy in a previous video. So if you want to watch that, I'll link it in the description below. Also, I'll put it up here. But pretty much his take on fashion can be summed up by this amazing quote by him. I hear about celebrities who have stylists, and that blows my mind. It's certainly, certainly not why I act, but I can wear cool clothes from some of the nicest designers in the world. So why am I gonna pay someone to figure out what I should be wearing? What's the fun in that? I mean, come on. So not only is this guy hitting the edge with fashion, but he's doing it on his own. He doesn't even hire a stylist. He goes straight to the designers. And he does it so well that he pushes the envelope just enough, but everybody still loves what he's wearing. And he gets all this attention from the people who are talking about fashion. And he's not even using a stylist. I'm, I'm telling you, that David Rose from Schitt's Creek can't even hold a candle to this kid. Ah, man. Timothy Chalamet handling it in the movies, handling it on fashion. He kind of has this mannequin looking about him though. It's a weird kind of like, he's got this lanky, I don't know. It's, it's very striking, a little weird, I'll be honest. Ladies would believe differently, but hey, you know. Nonetheless, highly, highly inspiring. So yeah, Timothy, I hate you because I want to be you. I like your fashion, you're highly inspiring. Actually, I love your fashion. And all the movies you've done are simply amazing. I'm not gonna watch the movie, um, what's it called? Uh, God, what's the, what's the movie about him being a drug drug dealer or a drug addict? Oh, no, that looks really 
Oh, it's rough. I can I I watched the trailer and I couldn't even get through the trailer without. Yeah, that's right. I cried. I cried in the trailer because I have a kid, and you know what? I can't. I, I can't. I can't imagine having to go that. Um, yeah. Anyways, what's the name of that damn thing? Beautiful boy. Ah, thanks. Yeah, beautiful boy. So, Timothy Chalamet, thanks for inspiring us. My name is Timothy Sands. This is Fashionable Father. If you liked this video, I think you'll like this video right here. Actually, this will be a playlist of all the videos I do about the gentleman I hate. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. Hit the like button if you agree with me. Always remember, never forget, style first. See you on the flip side. Mwah.